Welcome. Today's video is on King Charles the 3rd. King Charles the 3rd, formerly known as Prince Charles, Prince of Wales, is currently king of the United Kingdom and 14 other Commonwealth realms. He ascended to the throne on September 8th, 2022, upon the death of his mother, Queen Elizabeth II. He is the eldest son of Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh. He was created Prince of Wales on July 1st, 1958 and became heir apparent to the British throne on the death of his grandfather, King George VI, on February 6th, 1952. He is the longest-serving Prince of Wales in British history, having held the title of Prince of Wales for 69 years. Prince Charles Philip Arthur George was born to Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip Duke of Edinburgh on November 14, 1948 at Buckingham Palace in London, England. He was the first child of the royal couple and became heir apparent to the British throne upon his mother's accession in 1952. If you wish to know more about Queen Elizabeth II, the link will be in the description below. Charles's early education was conducted at Buckingham Palace where he was tutored by private instructors. At the age of 8, he was sent to Cheam School in Berkshire, England. In 1962, he moved to Gordonston School, a boarding school in Scotland, where he was known as Charlie. Gordonston was a progressive school that emphasized physical fitness and outdoor activities, which Charles initially found challenging. However, he eventually came to appreciate the school's ethos and developed a lifelong love for the outdoors. After graduating from Gordonston in 1967, Charles spent a year traveling around Australia and New Zealand. He then attended Trinity College, Cambridge, where he studied history. Charles was the first heir apparent to the British throne to earn a university degree. While at Cambridge, Prince Charles was a member of the Trinity College Boat Club and played polo for the university team. He also became interested in environmentalism and conservation. He also served as the president of the Cambridge Union, the university's debating society. Following his graduation from Cambridge in 1970, Charles joined the Royal Navy. He served on the ships HMS Norfolk, HMS Minerva, and HMS Jupiter. He also trained as a jet pilot with the Royal Air Force. Prince Charles left active military service in 1976. In 1981, Charles married Lady Diana Spencer. The couple had two sons, Prince William and Prince Harry. Diana became one of the most popular members of the royal family. However, the marriage was troubled and the couple divorced in 1996. If you wish to know more about Princess Diana, the link will be in the description below. In 2005, Charles married Camilla Parker Bowles. The couple had been involved in a long-running affair while Charles was still married to Diana. Camilla was initially unpopular with the public, but she has gradually won over many people with her warmth and charisma. As Prince of Wales, Charles has undertaken a wide range of public engagements throughout his life. He has represented the Queen on official visits. overseas and he has also carried out many charitable and environmental initiatives. Charles is a patron of over 400 charities and he has spoken out on a variety of issues including climate change, poverty and sustainable development. Upon his mother's death on 8th November 2022, Charles ascended to the throne as King Charles III. His coronation took place at Westminster Abbey on 6th May 2023. Charles has been involved in several controversies over the years. These have included his marriage to Diana, Princess of Wales, and his relationship with Camilla Parker Bowles. He has also been criticized for his outspoken views on environmentalism and other issues. Charles is a keen amateur painter and has exhibited his work at several galleries. He is also a patron of the arts and has a particular interest in classical music. Charles is a vegetarian and a teetotaler. He is also a keen advocate for organic farming and sustainable agriculture. The crown depicts Prince Charles as a complex and sensitive individual who struggles to find his place in the world. He is often overshadowed by his mother, Queen Elizabeth II, and he feels pressure to live up to her expectations. 
the series also explores Charles's troubled marriage to Diana, Princess of Wales, and his relationship with Camilla Parker Bowles. Prince Charles is an important character in The Crown for several reasons. First, he is the heir apparent to the throne and his story is therefore intertwined with the story of the British monarchy. Second, Charles's personal life has been the subject of much public scrutiny and his experiences provide a window into the challenges and pressures faced by members of the royal family. Third, Charles is a complex and multifaceted individual and his portrayal in The Crown offers a nuanced and insightful look at his character. King Charles III is a controversial figure, but he is also a popular one. He is seen by many as a caring and a compassionate man. He is also seen as a modernizer of the monarchy. He has been praised for his charity work and his environmental activism, but he has also been criticized for his close relationship with Camilla Parker Bowles and his support for the alternative medicine. He is a man of many contradictions, but he is also a man of great determination and commitment. It remains to be seen what kind of king he will be, but there is no doubt that he will play a significant role in British history. Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.